and action. Hey YouTube, it's Pavla and Tripod. Hey guys. Get back into it, doing an EDC video. I have a lot of cool stuff now. I've moved on up, I think. Uh, In other words, he's just spoiled fucking rotten. I've learned to buy stuff when I can. When we're struggling, why don't you go ahead and say it? In a household where my females like electronics, when we're scraping by, I can find all my cool stuff, and we always get through it up and down. But uh, anyway, I got a new watch for Christmas. We'll start there because I broke it today. I was all happy to do EDC video, and then I broke my new watch. It's right here. Another Casio. Well, don't move it. I can't find it now. There it is. But luckily, me and uh, his daughter were smart enough to buy the extended warranty. You bought, you broke the new, new watch I just bought you for Christmas. Yes, yeah. he did. Are you for real? Yes. Uh, what exactly is broken? I hit this on a wall, and this, it sounded like the glass fell out, but this ring came off. The bezel. And then I found a, a little pin, but I don't know if the pin had a spring or another ball in it. Because it doesn't, it doesn't click anymore and stay in place. Oh, chill out, Minnie. I made a claim. He's getting a new one. As you can see, Minnie Tripod has grown up a little bit, and she's now just an angry teenager. So, it's cool. The finish is, is wearing well. I've, I've been wearing it since Christmas. Oh, yeah, it is. It's not getting... Turn it again? It's like a shiny black. They call it PVD. Yeah, and it's not wearing off at all, is it? Off. I've hit it on cement a couple places, like right up here. I like it. I think it's more grown up than uh, having digital stuff all over, too. His G-Shock is little boyish, he said. The only... I didn't say that. <laughs> you would insult thousands of YouTubers. I was teasing you, big-ass <laughs> The only problem I do have with it is the date. It matches right now, but... I usually have to change it. I've tried changing it at midnight exactly. It's, it's a constant problem. See, and he's used to his other one that changes automatically every like 12 hours okay, to the. That's just one part of the What's that called? Going. The this atomic. Is not a atomic. The what? It's atomic and solar. Oh, well, yeah, something. that thing that. Yeah, that's what his G Shock okay. is. That's one part. I'm back to the G Shock. Oh. Which has a few scratches on the mineral, but wearing very well. So, watch. What else? Oh, I'm wearing a necklace. That's different. I got it at the Renaissance Fair. We went twice this year, guys. Yeah. Um, the first one I got, they actually minted there, but it was bad luck, so I can't wear it anymore. <laughs> you still so haven't told me one. why it's bad luck. And this one's good luck, so. Why is that other one bad luck? I, I don't know. Logistics. Nothing went right that day. So. And I'd rather pin it on a necklace than... That you just, just suck? Just put it away. Yeah. So, this one has been going well. What else? Keys are the same. Swiss Army Classic. That's Can my wedding ring on his thing, not his, by the I way. Did it focus on this? I know we're having problems. Yeah, it's focusing. Uh, this little light Jovan gave me. Still going strong. Sometimes when it's cold, it like flashes really quick. I don't know. Think of key. Mm, what else? Wallet. Wallet's new. Oh yeah, you got a cool new wallet. There's a wallet. That's pretty badass. I, I had to force him to get it. He carried that duct tape wallet I made him until like a month ago. I've been carrying this. My mom always buys me shit like this. You've been carrying that for as long as I can remember. Like there's one in the car that says, son, please drive safely. Yeah, because he's a sucky driver. Uh, the right back pocket is just scrap paper. Emergency TP, actually. Really. It's like a folded over paper towel. This is hair ties to the ladies. 
or tying up bags of chips. Clothespins for uniform if you lose a button or something. Those are safety Body pins. Pin. Yeah. Whatever they're called. Uh, back pocket is the small knife. It's usually this one. It's always usually this one. But today I use this one. San Remo 735. Does it not look like the cryo? It looks like a hinderer design. This has been out forever. It has a butterfly on it. Yes, it does have a butterfly on it. And it's a frame line. It's a stainless steel frame line. But it's usually this one. Yeah, he oh. carries the shit out of that one. Yeah. Uh, okay. Uh, front pocket. Uh, left. The new phone. His new Windows phone. It's the HTC 8X. That's just the lock screen. Here's what they... What's so damn fancy about it. Photos, it rotates through your photos. So, be careful what you take a picture of, because it'll rotate through the front of your phone. <laughs> so, yeah. I usually put the stuff I use most YouTube right there. And you all see what's front. right there? On the front, and the, the phone icon is small. You can make these huge like this, whatever you want to do. Did you see my name, guys? I'm on the front. And then, ooh, Judge Dredd versus Zombies. That's a good game. There's knife websites down here. And that's it, two screens. This, you can just keep adding websites, apps, whatever you want to pin to the start of it. And then this is all the apps and stuff. It doesn't have every app, but that's okay. I usually don't go through a lot of apps. Um, and those new Droid phones, they have like the five screens and all the icons on the bottom. It's too complicated for me. So this one's perfect. So, and it's got Gorilla Glass all the way around it, so he can't break it like the other one. Gorilla Glass too in the front, which hasn't scratched yet. And look how thin it is. This has a case on it. And it's even thinner than this. Yeah, I made him get a case. I usually am violently against cases, but I've dropped it right there in the corner. And the case ate it. The case is not damaged, but the phone would have been. So. And it's really purple. Cool. The camera is awesome. It's purple. Uh, okay. Because he's manly enough That's to use new, purple. Because my other one, the screen broke and screened it. Uh, bam! Made next Benza. Unique graphic. It's the expanded metal. You gotta set it down. It's. Yeah. It's expanded metal uh, one. I was having trouble using it. I finally cut through some double wall cardboard and scratched it right there. See it? Yeah. So now I can use it. So now it's okay. It was too pretty before. Um. I'm going to wear this lanyard till it wears off, and then I'll take it out. I figure it's on there. I might as well give it a shot. He puts them on there. So, pretty cool. I fold it over the corner. Like this, so the edge is right there. It doesn't dig into the back of my hand. Mm -hmm. mm, what else? Cargo pocket. Those are his Hobbit shorts. Thank you. Yeah, I was going to talk about that in a second. Always a hanky, wiping my beard, stuff like that, spills. Mm. Oh, new flashlight. What kind of flashlight? Uh, don't you forget. It's a Phoenix PD32 Ultimate Edition. It's like this much longer, this heatsink right here. Makes it a little longer than the regular PD32. I needed a brighter one than this one for searching out crackheads in alleys and occasionally we'll have to I'll have to inspect houses like houses that were empty so I want to make sure it's nice and bright so I see everything right away it just blows up the inside of rooms right away whereas this one you gotta hunt and search um, Headphones, for the first time, my, the speaker on that phone 
does not sound near as good as the headphones. It has Beats audio, mm -hmm. which work when you plug in your headphones. So. Right. Uh, pin, which I just lost the cap in my pocket. Oh, God. Oh, God. There we go. Black hole in there, Jesus. There we go. Pin. I haven't got a fancy pin because I, I lose them maybe once a week. Lighter. Tried to quit smoking, so I got all these. Yes, I did. Ones. It's been what, babe, now five weeks? Going on five weeks? Almost two months. It's not five weeks. More than that. It's February 2nd, it had only been two days. Oh, dazzle me with math. Okay, you win. Five weeks, whatever you want to say it is. It's been a while. Bite me, bitch. I carry a lighter for, um, like at work, people get to the hospital, they don't, they don't bring most of their stuff, so I let them use it to light their smoke. What else is in here? A random receipt. Garbage. Oh, microfiber cloth. <laughs> I've been moving, okay. Hey, I got two of those for 35 bucks. Those are some amazing cloths. When I first got the Sabenza, I was wiping the blade with this. I didn't want to scratch it with my t-shirt. But now I scratched it with cardboard. So I'll probably phase that out. I got one of those for my computer screen, which is a touch screen on and my laptop. I yanked one. And he jacked it for his okay. Sabenza. Okay, nothing else. Uh, what's this? <clears throat> I have added a gun to my EDC. Here in Arizona, you don't need a concealed weapons permit to carry open carry or concealed carry. You don't need one. It's all right. So, I love Arizona for that. And I was carrying it in my front pocket in this Black Hawk holster. So, Christmas time, I was looking for smaller knives. I was like, I don't have a knife here banging into my gun. I want this pocket free. But, uh, I bought the same gun I had years ago, and, uh, I bought a holster for it, that's right there, the uh, DeSantis Insider, and it is really comfortable here. I always thought, I'm usually bony, you know, so sitting in the car, it would dig into me, but it's really comfortable, and it's really, it's just as accessible, so I kind of had to change around my EDC to fit the gun in anybody else have to do that. I was like, I'm going to have to, if I had the gun in my front pocket, I would have to put, like, a knife back here. Well, you could have left your gun in the front pocket and not had to have bought the Sabenza. Like, this one, I, like, this is a big knife. I thought would not have been comfortable in my back pocket. But when that came out for sale, I wanted it. So... I had to add that. You put all that shit in your pockets? So now I can have whatever knife that, I want. I'm asking you a question. A huge can, knife. Does that, all that right there, all that crap right there go in your pockets every day? It stays in the pockets. I don't take it out every day. How the hell do you keep your pants up? You have an entire purse. No, strong. You have an entire purse in your pockets. I think I don't, I don't take anything out when I change the jeans either. Jesus. You have an entire purse in your pockets. My pants weigh a lot, yeah. I think those pants weigh more than you do. When you need something, you ask, though. My purse. Your purse. That's not me. No, that's you. Oh. That is my new purse. It's not a Gucci, it's a Keith. And, uh, my wife's on me. <laughs> Why'd you jack my knife? I sharpened it. You had it in that bag when you changed purses over the trash stuff to look over, so I just took it out of there. And I sharpened it. I lost my knife, guys. Oh, her tough thumbs knife? Yeah. My tough thumbs knife. I'm pretty sure someone stole it. Oh, the, the pistol is a kill tech 380. You, you can pull it out. It's the second generation. If you set it down, I'll... They changed the extractor on the second gen. But uh, I had one of these originally when they came out. Before the Ruger LCP... But uh, when I first had it, I was using the the Nemesis from DeSantis. It kind of leaves the part of it open. 
So I did like this cheap Blackhawk one you find at Walmart. See, it covers it, covers the whole thing. Well, that is the one I got you at Walmart, huh? And it looks, it just looks like a wallet. Kind of, a lot of people carry wallets in their front pockets. I, I can't even see it in your Hobbit shorts. And then, you know, stuff starts happening. Just put your hand on your pistol. So, I was going to carry it in my pockets. It's still an option, but I, I prefer it back here. So that is the EDC right now. Since I've got the Sabinza, I've been carrying that. I got these three knives for Christmas. I have a few other knives too. That one? Got lots to make videos on. That one? And that one? Yes, we're going to be making videos for most of the night, guys. These are two autos. Uh, you know, I kept seeing auto reviews. And people were like, man, I wish I could carry one. I'm like, wait a minute. I can. I can, so I'm exercising my knife rights. And I thought... So, at Christmas, I could have got a Sabenza then. But I was like, oh, I haven't had a bunch of new knives in a while like I used to. So I got three, thinking this would, this would feel like a Sabenza, but... It's super nice. It's perfect. Never carried it. I'm trying to, you know, when you get new, a whole bunch of new knives at one time, it's hard to carry them all. So, I think maybe one at a time is good, but uh, this is just way lighter than a Sabenza. Maybe if the titanium had been thicker, it would feel more like one. But I will perfect. say that I am learning my knives even more because while we were sitting here and I was waiting for him to get ready to make his video, I said, you know, Spyderco totally copied Chris Reeve. That totally looks like a Chris Reeve knife. And then I learned... They did that on purpose. It's the Sage series, yes. Well, they did a good job then. Oh, and I wanted a Sage because uh, I like that Spyderco cat that I've got. It's about, it's like smaller than this, but it's basically the same shape. Uh, this is, these are the rounds I like from my pistol, PX1. Just a heads up, you spent 17 minutes and 30 seconds emptying out and your this, pants. In this, <laughs> <laughs> these are just full metal jackets for the extra clip. Anywho, that's EDC right now. Can I have like 30 seconds now? For what? Okay, guys, so we totally moved into a new house. Yeah. There's I'm the new floors. Busy with that. That's, we've been super busy. This is the new house, brand new walls. It was completely gutted, brand new couch. We still gotta get the curtains up. Kinda looks like a bachelor's pad. That's all her stuff in the corner over here. Kitchen, bathrooms, bedrooms that way. Brand new laminate. I still think we should convert this to a knife cabinet. Yeah, no. Show them the inside and show them why. Blankets can go anywhere. But show them why you like it so much. See, it's got, it's got like all these drawers. That he needs to fix. And I could put, you know, knife displays here. Or it's like the Lion, the Witch, and the Warrior kind of thing. But for knives. <laughs> Keith, don't break my <laughs> shelf. Get out. Pav, I swear to God, get out of there. See, I would totally go to Narnia. So, this is our new house, and I only have one predicament. That. And I know a lot of you guys are gamers, and I tried to put everything through that little thing in the back there that's supposed to hold up all the cords. It doesn't work. And every I need these hooked up to that TV. I'm just going to say too many games. But I need my Xbox and my Wii. Can somebody please help me with that? Why not move some of the game systems to the rooms? On what TV? And no, because I need my games on this TV because I can see everything on this TV. Not a nice TV, guys. And it's 3D. That was my present. That's beautiful. But um, I need help with that. And I know you gamers have the same issues. 
So could somebody please give me an idea? Maybe a different, like, little entertainment center than those? Something. Okay, I'm done. Yeah, something to shove the cords behind. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, something to shove the cords behind. Emptying my pants for 17 minutes. You did. You emptied your pants for 17 minutes and 37 <laughs> seconds. Oh, hat, because my hair is out of control. I could totally empty my purse a lot faster than you emptied your pants. Oh, hey guys, you know what else? So somebody's birthday was the other day. Ooh, whose birthday, babe? Babe, whose birthday? That was mine. Yeah, your whole thir you're 34 years old. Damn it, you old man. Am I 34? So yes, I? you're 34, because I'm going to be 35. So, oh, look at me. Will you look at the video? You're making me sick. Okay, so we didn't do much for his birthday. I didn't go buy him no expensive knife. So, instead, I bought him tickets to the comic Jim Jeffries. Look at the camera, babe. Show him how happy you are. We get to go see that Wednesday. And then, next weekend... It's we're Thursday. It's Thursday, yes, sorry. <clears throat> Thursday we're going. Babe, look at the camera. Babe. And then next weekend, he gets to go where? Uh, we're going to the Monkey Muster. Oh, I almost forgot. Monkey Muster is in Mesa. Uh-huh. We're in Phoenix by the Capitol buildings, so it's not too far. And we already VIP'd our spots. I don't know if I can scrape some together to buy something there, but... I will get you a few hundred. It's pretty cool. Like I need something else. And now you spread pretty happy shit. With this. Is that this the Benza? I can't see. Sorry. Yeah. So anything else? You got anything else nope. to say? Well, could you at least say bye? Yeah. See you guys later. I got lots more stuff over there to look at. Keep watching. We'll make a few more. Bye, guys.